Now nah, we're taking this. We're taking this fight. You know, he's a ch he's a champion, so we're taking this fight 100% serious. We're not we're not banking on no, you know, car accident or or layoff and all those type of things. Um, we're taking this 100% serious. Like I said before, we we wanted this fight the, on January 25th. But, you know, things happen. Then the COVID happened, so. We just had to stay um, focused and, you know, the world had to weather the COVID storm and all the crazy th things that's going on in the world. But now the fight's finally here. You know, we're three and a half weeks away and, you know, I feel like camp is going great and we're going to go in there and have a great performance. Yeah, you got to understand. Yeah. You got to understand, like Danny said, it was, it was uh, for January when we for a red car, I mean, red catch was supposed to be uh, Spence, but then he got into that tragedy. But that's the past. So we're not looking at the accident because we're not doctors. He's clear by medical. His team say he's good. Everybody else saying he's good. To us, he's good. We can't worry about that. That's something that it doesn't make the fight better or worse. We're not gonna we're not gonna go in there thinking that he was in a car accident that we got the advantage. We're not falling for that booby trap. That's a booby trap. All we know is December 5th, we're going to go to Dallas. We're going to fight Spence and Danny. We're going to fight, and we're coming home victorious. That's all we got to worry about. Everything else is pushed to the side. It don't mean nothing to us. Like, it don't mean nothing. I, I, I had cancer. I had an accident. I had a motorcycle accident, and I'm here. So as long as you get medical clearance from a doctor, we ain't going over there thinking he, got a, he had an accident. We're going to go in there and smack him around, he's done. You know, we gotta respect him, he's a champ. So we're going in there, we're gonna fight. And we're gonna fight December 5th, and we're gonna have a great fight. And at the end of that night, and now new. And that's how it's gonna work out. Look, I, you know, I never look at tapes from past fights from Danny's opponents. So we're not gonna learn nothing from Dan, him and uh, Garcia, Mikey. No, you can't learn nothing from that. And what I do is, when I train Danny, I focus on Danny. I don't worry about looking at video because I'm not, I, I'm hopeless against that. I can't change nothing that they got over there. I know what I can make Danny better. So we've been working on things that's going to, we're going to dictate the fights. First of all, we're going to be on top of him. So we're not going to do like Mikey did. You know, he ran, you know, all night. You know, he was glad he was out of there. <laughs> you know, he was, he was glad he took the check home, I bet. But we're not looking at that. We're looking at going to Texas in Dallas in Dallas Stadium, because you know they got a little rival, the Eagles against Dallas. So we going out there, we're gonna sit on their helmet. On Dallas Stadium, we're gonna sit on their helmet after Danny wins the title. So I can't tell you what we got, but we're gonna bring anything he got, we're gonna respond to anything he brings to the table. You know, I, I, after the Mikey fight and uh, you know the Porter fight, you know, I saw some holes in his game and I felt like, you know, it's a good opportunity for me to, you know become champion again so and he's you know he's a great champion I'm a great champion and I feel like these type of fights bring out the best in Danny Garcia you know they make me run that extra mile they make me spar that extra round they make me eat the right meals and they gave me the extra motivation I need and I feel like this is the type of fight that's going to bring out the best in me and that's why I wanted it. For all the best boxing content follow PBC on Fox on Twitter, Facebook, Instagram and YouTube. Thank you for watching. Well, if you enjoyed that clip, make sure you click uh, somewhere around here and subscribe from Fight Highlights to exclusive interviews. We have got everything you need as a boxing fan right here on PBC on Fox.